Hey everyone, this year for our Memorial Day trip we went to Northwest Arkansas. We did a little zip lining, we spent some time hiking, and uh, we did some canoeing on the Buffalo River. It was an amazing time. We stayed at this great big lodge. We fished, there were horses that we fed, we had farm fresh eggs every morning for breakfast. It was an amazing, amazing trip. And like always, we did it with people who we love and care about, and, uh, and we filmed it. Hope you guys enjoy. So what did you get? What do, what have you guys been doing? Fish fishing. Fishing. Did you catch anything? No. Yes. Yeah. Yes. What did you catch? I, I caught, caught a perch and a bass. I just caught a bass. I caught air. How big were they? Uh, uh mine was about like this big ish or something. Like that. That's a good fish story right there. <laughs> Why are you wet? Uh, because I swim in a lake. What lake? That lake. Oh, you mean that pond? Yeah. Is it cold? done some zip lining which was awesome had a great time and now we are headed back towards the lodge we're gonna go to do a little hike uh, on the Lost Valley Trail there's supposed to be a, a nice little waterfall there and a cave where we can put our headlights on and crawl in and explore and so that's the next plan
Mr. Kyle, have we, uh, have you ever been inside a, uh, a cave with a 60 foot waterfall? No, but I think I'm in one now. It's gonna be awesome. <laughs> That's all. What do you think about 60 foot waterfall? Dude, that is uh, incredible. Look how black it is. You can't see anything. Yeah, this part. So, what we're looking at here is people are trying to crawl through this cave to get back out from where we were with the waterfall. <laughs> Tell me about what we just did. We walked in the woods in Arkansas. Okay, your turn. What did we just do? We ramboed, as we called it in P class, through probably 18 inches for many yards deep, and we saw a, probably a 50-foot waterfall inside drop right in front of us. It was amazing. Never seen anything like it. Yeah. It was awesome. <laughs> it was awesome. <laughs> On the airplane we're going to tell you how to fly it. When the boat tips over you want to lay on your back and go feet first so you don't want to hit a rock with your head. Butterfly Thatcher, look, just landed on my hand. Look at it. <laughs> huh? You like that? That looks like a little copperhead right there. That is, that's a little copperhead. This is awesome. This is like that was actually really good. No, no. Two. All right. Go two. Here. Oh, 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 that? 18. Oh, pretty good to the other side. Very, very fun. 
They just tip over on the tree bridge? No, I never tip. We never tip over. Good job. Can you take it? We see that Mr. Heaver is awarding his children with popcorn and water. That's the best way to get them to do things. So how was the last rapid? Did you flip or did it or did you take the chances? Well, I did neither because Lily and I walked it. Did you flip, Kason? I did, and I got caught on a tree branch. Oh. Fell twice. The last one was a doozy. Went over the higher part. You flipped. Luckily, your aunt Crystal and Miss Jessica were next to me. I grabbed onto yeah. theirs and floated. Two minutes. And we didn't tempt. Crystal and I, you know, we rocked it. Jude is our partner, but it was fun. Did some swimming. Did some rock skipping. About five minutes in, the Morses uh, wrapped their canoe around a rock. Great. How was the ride? It was awesome. I flipped once. Well, it was at the very start. We got stuck on a rock. The boat was bending. <laughs> and I lost my oar. And fortunately, there were a lot of big, strong, friendly Arkansas guys to help us get it off. So we've had our adventure already, and we're going to go ahead and start. It's 10.30. smart people trying to figure out how to drink wine. Oh! Oh! <laughs> what is that right there on the old? Yeah, that's He's so good. good. So what is, ha what is happening right here? <laughs> so the females in our group. The wine dripped just a tad when I was pouring it. So I'm putting a color on our wine bottle so that it doesn't drip. I am very, very sophisticated. So now it will not drip when I serve the ladies. That color really seems to make a difference there, Kyle. <laughs> so wait until I turn it up. This is the action shot. You ready? Are you I'm ready? ready? Here your action shot. No drip. No drip. No drip. No drip. Thank you. User error. This is Grant Hemer. He's the founder of Noel Wood Ales, English Porter. We've got a Sati, a Hefeweizen. The Dirty Sanchez version. You can see their mustaches. An Amber Ale, and a German Pilsner, and a Czech Pilsner, and a Baltic Porter. Here's what I have on, on draft right now. That's my favorite. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.